Hey, hey, how's it going? Welcome back. Welcome in. My name is Kurigarin K. And let's find out what's going on today. Um, yeah. I think we should be heading over to the other guy. Maybe. Actually, I'm not sure, right? Do we have to finish the um, Princess Lake thingy? before we do this or we are just locked off you know forever so i'm still not entirely sure if i should continue uh what haruka is doing or just we can just head off into the investigation um so yeah wait i'm pretty sure i can change Free for a little while, so it's a good time to get some stuff done. Yeah, see, I don't know if this is telling me that I should go for the princess leak thing. I guess we have to see. It's suddenly so quiet, right? I guess because it's in Haruka's room. <laughs> and that's why it's so quiet. Oh, so I do go to my apartment. Oh. <laughs> yeah, it's been a while, so I don't exactly remember where I'm supposed to be. I'm gonna head back to the office. What? Yeah, I'm gonna head back to the office. Uh, just to check something. Where's my office? Wonder how's everyone doing back home? Miss it alright? Interview with Okinawa Tourism. Nearly forgot. Oh, I got an email. What? Thanks for the money. Don't overdo it. Okay, we saw you on TV the other day. Ah, okay, okay. Very nice. Oh, they're all watching me on TV. That's so nice. It makes me happy, even though it's kind of embarrassing. I can kind of see that. I better write back. I'm so glad to hear from you. Is everything okay back home? Okay. Oh, she answered back already. She's getting good at this email thing. We are fine. We are as happy as ever here. How about you? Want us to send you some... Goya? What's Goya? Is that... Some sort of food product? Wait, Goya? Is this bitter melon? Yeah, don't have to worry. Of course I don't want them to worry about me now. Let's see. No, thanks. I'm good on Goya. So I'm gonna do an interview for a tourism magazine. Maybe you all get to read it. Okay. Is this telling me that I got to do it? Yeah, I'll get them excited. I'll wait to see how they react. <laughs> Come on, Ayako. Why are you taking so long to write back? Oh, yeah, she's lonely, right? Oh, here we go. Is that interview the one where you answer questions from readers? Make sure you do a good job. Nice. Mm, why is she being so pushy? I'll just tell her. Okay, thanks, Ayako. I'm off to work now. Talk later. Love, Haruka. It's a relief to hear everything's alright back home. That last message was weird though. Hmm, interesting. What's happening back home? Uh oh. It's time for the interview. Okay. I guess we do need to go somewhere. Wait. This way. This way. Okie dokie. Oh no wait. That's my house. <laughs> okay. Where is this mall? Uh... Oh, 
one cutie sunrise what tell me um oh huh? it's a mall right <gasps> i should have gone to the karaoke 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 with um haruka just to see what kind of songs she would sing right uh which one is my office i forgot ah this one okay maybe i go there and then i um see i was right it's the other way oh no this way oh sorry and then we go straight down so yeah maybe we pick it up from the office this way We do live quite close to the office, huh? Must be nice, right? You don't have to spend too much time uh, walking around. Oh. Wait a minute. Aren't you... Pardon? It is you. I knew it. Sawamura-san, right? I'm Fuyamoto. Surely you've heard of me. Uh, Can't say I have, actually. No, I'm very sorry. I'm afraid I haven't. The streets are so empty all of a sudden. <laughs> oh, I guess they're feeling in now. <laughs> they're all walking in a straight line. <laughs> there's a lot of people that's tired. Oh, that's the end. Oh, no. <laughs> that's funny. I'm on TV a lot, but I suppose you're much too... Easy to watch TV. I've seen you on the Princess League, by the way. Anyway, I'm producing a special event right here in Sotenbori. The main goal of the event is to provide for the audience an intense and ex exciting battle between idols, live and in person. We gather nearly 100 idols together in one spot and have them perform. And then the live audience rates them by voting. Is this... Yeah, it does sound similar. Yes, but what sets this event apart is that everyone can come to see the whole thing live. Live, not pre-recorded. That's right. 99... Uh, 99 idols battling it out on live... <laughs> My brain. 99 idols battling it out live on a Sotenbori stage. The event is called Sotenbori Battle Royale 99 or SBR 99 for short. That's a very long name. I've heard of that but I didn't know it was the name of an event. Yes, many people are under the mistaken impression that it's the name of a group. Anyway, I'm glad you've heard of it. Idols compete in three categories, dance battle, concert event, and a handshake event. Audience then votes on those performances. Oh, I get raided on a handshake event too. Now to come to the point, do you think you might be interested in competing? I'll think about it. Who? Me? That's right. I'm sorry to ask you like this on the street after a chance meeting, but I think this might be fate. Um, maybe, but I think you should go through my agency first. What do you think? Hmm, well, and not only that, but I also think it would be a chance to grow as well. Maybe, but I think you should still go through my agency first. After all, I'm underage and I don't know if you're going to be sketchy. Chance to grow. That's right. As I mentioned before, SBR 99 takes place before a live audience. In this competition, idols get to experience the pressures of direct audience voting in addition to a little friendly competition. What better environment to help an idol grow? Perhaps? I'm... yeah, I don't know. I'm not familiar with like Japan's idol scene. I don't know how sketchy this is or isn't. I'm sure you find the experience of battling out with other idols of your generation in such an exciting event to be truly enriching. Maybe. 
It does sound like it could be a good experience. Most definitely. You still need to go through my agency, though. Oh, what should I do? If I lose, it could cause problems. I firmly believe it's better to try something and regret it later than to regret not trying it at all. And I would say that of all the ladies... Um, no, not yet. I appreciate the offer, but I'm afraid I'll have to say no. That's too bad. I guess I did ask you out of the blue, so if you ever change your mind, please don't hesitate to come back and see me. Ah, uh, I guess this is one of those, like, side quest thing. Okay, okay, okay. Hey. Maybe I should try. I don't know. I should do that interview thing first, though. How much should I push, right? Because I do want to find out the, um... Uh, find out the bottom of things. Or rather, get to the bottom of things. Oh, okay. I actually did all of that. So I guess I can just... Yeah. Where's the one magazine handshake event? Oh, is it this one? Beginner magazine interview. Which one was it? That's idol concert. Let's do all the interviews then. I don't really want to let the uh, kids down back home. So let's do them. Oh. Let's see what Yam Yamaura-san's memo says. Fashion magazine aimed at pre-teens and teens. Otani-san, she's an old, unmarried career woman. She's nice enough, but is very particular about professionalism. Okay. Consists of questions from readers asking for advice. This will mostly be about love and relationships. We're not that knowledgeable about it, right? Try to give responses that readers will be able to relate to. Remember, if you want to be a popular idol, you have to appeal to the young female audience as well. Okay. For this kind of interview, it's also important to make a favorable impression on the interviewer. Their experience with you will affect the tone of the article they write. True. Alright. Relatable. And very particular about professionalism. Let's try this. Hello. I'm here for an interview with Haruka-chan. Oh, the interview is here. Alright, let's see what we've got. Oni Chiwa. I'm Kotoni. Kotani from Kiss Kiss. It's very nice to meet you, Haruka chan. You as well. Thank you very much for coming. I imagine your manager has already explained everything to you. You are aware of what today's interview is about. Uh, relationship advice for readers. I was told there would be questions from readers asking for relationship advice. Yes, good. So you are prepared. Now then. Those from middle school and high school have written in, asking for advice on their relationship troubles. Just answer the way you think is best. Okie dokie. Alright. And remember, our readers will be able to take heart if they see that even a cute idol like yourself has been through some of the same things they have. I guess that's, yeah, logical. Now on to the questions. Remember, these are middle school and high school age girls like you. So just answer the way you normally would. Alright, I'll try. Here we go. Mina-chan in Tokyo, middle school student. My friend and I both like the same boy. What would you do if you were in my shoes? Oh. Um. Go off 
wanted to boy myself, I would ask my friend to let me have him. I will let my friend have him. Ooh. Oh. I didn't choose that, but... Okay, I guess there is a timing. Hmm. I guess that was a tough one, but you have to say something. Oh. Okay. I see. I really apologize. Ah, uh, okay. There is a timing. Alright. Next question is from Iri Chan, Gifu Prefecture. My boyfriend is shy. We've been going out for six months, but we still never kissed. Some of my friends have gone further in less time. What do I do? Well, you should respect the guy, right? Uh, you should try set to. You should kiss him. Mm. Be assertive. If he's shy. There's no telling how long you have to wait before he does. Oh my, you're quite bold, aren't you, Haruka-chan? I don't know. I just believe that if you want something to happen, sometimes the best thing to do is make it happen yourself. That is true. Ah, I like your way of thinking. It's very refreshing. Oh, thank you. But doesn't it take a lot of courage for a girl to make the first move? I suppose it does, but... At this day and age, you know, hey, we're not going to follow the ancient uh, girls must do this, guys must do that kind of thing, right? <laughs> Maybe so, but sometimes a girl just needs to be brave. That's a pretty brazen thing for an idol to say. I imagine the reactions will be mixed, but I'll try to give it a favorable slant. Oh, thank you very much. Last question. It's a pretty serious one. It's from Apple Chan, Tochigi Prefecture. My friend has been. Oh. My friend has been seeing her teacher who is married with children. I keep telling her she should break it off with him, but she just won't listen. This is tough. This is very tough. Oh. I'm not sure this would. If your friend will listen, maybe you can try to re reason with the teacher instead. Because I don't know if you keep continually talk to your friend considering they've already ignored you for a while. Yeah. I don't think you should break up with your friend though. Because it's going to be pretty isolating for the friend. I'm sure this teacher wouldn't want it getting out he's in a re relationship with his student. Talking to him might make him rethink his decisions. But if you go to the teacher, won't the friend be really upset? She might be, but if you care about her, then it's the right thing to do. After all, no one wins in that kind of relationship. Yeah, very true. When it gets out, she's still going to be rejected by society in a way because she's going after married men right and he has kids as well ew isn't mm, okay i'm not gonna comment further but yeah that's kind of gross you know that's pretty true a relationship like that doesn't make anybody happy in the end hmm maybe i should break up with my man too oh um, sorry? Oh, nothing. I was just thinking out loud. Right. That concludes our interview. Thank you for your time. Very different from how I imagined you. I believe our readers will be split on what they think of you after this. Uh-oh. I think I might have done a bad job. However... You've given me more than enough to put together a decent article. I hope we can do this again sometime. Alright. Oh, I don't know. How am I going to... Enhance lessons? Uh, what does that mean? <laughs> I have no idea. Alright. Take on hard lessons. 
Hard lessons are more exhausting, but more rewarding if successful. Okay. Uh, let me do the other interview stuff. Um, this one. I don't really want to miss out on it. Like, yeah. Okay, tell me. Television shows and personalities aim towards a casual reader. So it primar primarily focuses on things like idols' hobbies and personal preferences. Okay, pretty aggressive and will likely attempt to get a rise out of you. Try to keep your cool. Oh, okay. If he likes you, he'll write a really great article. So try to win him over, okay? I'll try. Oh, Princess League. Okay. Uh, try to stay calm. I'll try to stay calm. Oh no. I'm here for the interview. Hello. Let's see what you are. Oh, okay. <laughs> he has a pretty funny hairstyle. Harube from TV Smash. Nice to meet you. Hello. Thank you very much for coming. Sure. Now, let's start today's interview. Let's see. Uh-oh. What was I going to ask you about today? Wow. You're not prepared. I was told it was going to be about the Princess League. Oh yes, that's right. The Princess League. So your manager did prepare you. Yes, of course. That's great. This agency is pretty small, so I was a little worried, to be honest. But it looks like they prepped their talent well. Hopefully, <laughs> hopefully I do well. Let's get right to it, shall we? So what do you think about the Princess League system? Um, sorry? I mean, it must be great for unknown talent like you. You can get your face on TV even without much proven experience. Ooh, is this starting now? Is he trying to get a rise out of me? Plus, the station can produce a profitable TV show without having to pay his talent much. A win-win, right? Ooh. On the other hand, the level of talent is often hit or miss. Don't you think that lowers the overall quality of this type of program? Yikes. But it's a very good opportunity for diamonds in the rough, right? Taking all that into consideration, is the Princess League system really all that great? Um, ooh, I think that's a question for the director. It's a great chance for girls to compete. The wonderful thing about the Princess League is that it gives girls a chance to compete and truly try their very hardest as something worthwhile. Are you saying that you don't care if the viewers have to watch low quality performances? Uh oh. Not at all. I don't feel the quality of my own performance is low. And I believe all the contestants train hard and do their absolute best. I see. Well, I have to agree. When I saw you perform, I really thought you had something special. And I could tell you've been through some pretty grueling trailing. Tra- what? You've been through some pretty grueling- Grueling training. I guess if the system produces performers like you, it must have some merit. Well, moving on. Another problem I see with the Princess League system. Performances are rated by studio audience voting. That's a pretty vague criterion, don't you think? Can singing and dancing really be evaluated with a numerical score? Well, that depends on how many people vote for you, right? So in a sense, it's a gauge for how much your performance move or interested the audience, right? Uh, I think the scoring system is fair. Performances vary in quality and I think the scores reflect that pretty accurately. A performance can be technically skilled but that isn't always what appeals to an audience. Yep, yep. 
Sometimes the value of a performance goes beyond technique, wouldn't you agree? Of course, but the scores are the votes of each audience member, and I think they reflect how much the performer touched their heart individually. Yep, this is pretty much what I was saying, but Haruka put it really much nicer. Really much nicer. <laughs> Very much nicer. Hmm? So I don't believe the Princess League scores are based on technique alone. You've got a point there. Mm, that's a pretty good answer, actually. Oh, thank you. I might be crushing this. So that brings us to my last question. Now, to tell you the truth, I used... Oh. To be a huge fan of a certain idol named Mireille Park. Is this Park Sun? Oh. You were Park Sun's fan? That's right. And I know you were her favourite, so let me ask you this. Do you believe you will surpass her one day? Oh, tough question. I'm going to try my hardest. I'm going to try my hardest to surpass her. Park San is a personal idol of mine. Good luck to you then. From what I've seen, I think you just might be able to do it. Oh, thank you. Do you really think so? Are you surprised? Anyway, thank you for the great comment there at the end. That will really round out the article. Anyways, that concludes our interview. I want to apologize to you. I know I was pretty harsh at times. <gasps> Wait, does this mean I won him over? Oh? It's just my interviewing style. I find that being harsh and aggressive elicits. Elicits? Elicits more heartfelt responses than being friendly does true i guess i hope you can conf i hope you can forgive me if i was too hard on you that's not really too hard though mm. that's all right my manager warned me in advance that your questions would be like that oh really hmm. kind of defeats the whole purpose if you know about it ahead of time <laughs> well too bad <laughs> Nevertheless, you really gave me some great material. I had high hopes for you. And you didn't disappoint. I'll be rooting for you. Oh, thank you. Thank you for today. Of course. Nice. Right. Now we've got the last interview to do. Hopefully it's one of the ones that I needed to do. Let me double check. Queen Soko. Oh, I need to do this as well. Just cause I want to practice loneliness loop. Take part in a hip hop dance event. Run and go. Late night show. Pool competition. Okay, this is the right. Fishing fever. Oh, that is cool. I get to fish. Catch a challenge. Oh wait, love to see you smile. One of Sultan's TV. Sultan TV's flagship shows. Love quiz. Handshake event. Mini concert. Yeah. These are all the interview ones. Okay, let's just do it. Alright, what do you have for me? Provides audition information and leads on how to become a model. Huh? Three teen and teen girls who want to be famous, just the kind of reader who will be fascinated by your story. Asano san, brand new to this, so I don't know how smoothly it will go. She's sure gung ho, though. 
interview will be about how you became an idol. I don't think she'll delve into your past too deeply. But you have a complicated family history. Make sure you track carefully. Uh oh, this is gonna be hard. Okay. About how I became an idol and to encourage teenage girls. Got it. Hello, so sorry I'm late. Oh, you're late. Come on in. Welcome in. You've got pretty funny hairstyle as well. <laughs> I'm from beginner. Nice to meet you. Hello. Thank you very much. Now let's see. Has your manager already told you um, how I became an idol? Yes, that's right. Many of our readers are girls who dream of being famous one day. Yep, yep. Sounds wonderful, great. And I'm so glad you've already been prepared. That should make things go a lot more smoothly. Okay, let's get started. Now, I heard that you were scouted out in Okinawa. Yes, that's right. They say you were just out shopping when somebody suddenly came up to you with an offer. So what's your secret? Do you have, do you have any tips for us on how to get noticed like you did? Oh, I have no idea though. Um, just, just like natural. I think the best thing to do is just be yourself and act natural. If you go overboard trying to catch the eye of a scout, it might look strange. I see. I guess there really isn't any foolproof, foolproof trick to getting noticed, huh? I was only discovered by the president of my agency by chance. I guess it's just luck and being in the right place at the right time. Uh oh, I'm not giving them uh any <laughs> any like secrets or stuff to get noticed. So maybe the good. Mm, I might not be good doing well in this interview. Yeah. Uh oh but yeah i don't know i feel bad tricking them you know maybe if you have that certain something it shows even when you're just being yourself all right moving on what was the very first job you had after becoming an idol i have no idea and i don't mean dance lessons or anything like that i mean a real paying gig if i recall it was being a Guest assistant on a TV show. Okay, she answered for me. Whew, I don't have to do it. It was part of the promotion of the Princess League. What kinds of things does a TV show assistant do? I held signs and posters toward the camera. I basically just stood there and said nothing. Seeing as you were already an idol, did you, you find that sort of thing a little humiliating? A little bit, I suppose, but... I was just happy to be on TV. I never thought anything like that would ever happen to me. <laughs> I can imagine. I think if I had a chance to be on TV, I'll grab it no matter what it was. Now that you're getting so much attention. It's hard to believe there was ever a time like that for you. Well, we all gotta start somewhere, right? Oh, there absolutely was. Ooh, it must be so exciting to be an idol. I'm a little jealous. Really? Alright, this next one is my last question. Do you have any regrets about becoming famous? Hmm. Hmm? Well, the more famous you become, the harder it is to just be a reg regular girl, right? I guess that is true. That is true. Hmm. You're probably discouraged from having romantic relationships. And people must recognize you wherever you go. Kinda. With these negative side effects, would you still recommend trying to become famous to our readers? Well, as long as you are aware of the negative side effects. 
and it's still your dream after that, I guess you should go for it, right? Uh, you have to know what you're getting into, yeah. I believe you have to know what you're getting yourself into ahead of time, if you want to be famous. Ah, nobody can escape the price of fame, is that it? Yep. Exactly. Well, that may be true. I can't help but feel our readers will think that answer is a little too obvious. Uh-oh. <laughs> they will? Alright. Yeah, I don't think I did very well for that. Looks like I made the right choice. Hmm? My editor... told me to go out and get an interview with one of my favourite idols. Oh. And then I saw you on the Princess League. And instantly became a friend. <gasps> I see. You did. How nice. That's... <laughs> that sounds so flat. Like, and emotionless. Emotional... Emotionless. Emotionless. Now that I've met you in person, you're just what I imagine. I guess I've got a good eye, right? I suppose so. <laughs> thank you for your compliment. Well, thank you again. Remember, I'll be rooting for you. Best of luck. Thank you so much. Ooh, 2000. Nice. Alrighty, alrighty. Enhanced media. Okay. I wonder if that gives me more jobs. Hmm. We'll see, we'll see. Take on new TV and press jobs. Oh, okay. So there are new TV and press jobs. So let's see. Um, okay, okay. Normal, special, interview. Oh. Eh. A men's magazine that covers racy topics. I don't think I want to do that. Yeah, I don't think I want to do that. Uh, let's go for a dance. Yeah, I don't know which is the... Oh, these are all sides. Then what are the rest? Hmm... Oh, press. Ah, uh, TV. I see. Okay, okay, okay. Makes sense. Publicity. Yeah, okay. Mm, yeah, let's go for this. Oh, no, no, no. No, not, not this. This one. Let's do normal. Okay. I'm earning money. For my kids? For the rest of the kids? In the orphanage? Yes, thank you, thank you. A lot of gas. Let's go. Uh, guess I don't need to. Done this before. Yep. It shouldn't be different. I just need to dance, right? Alright. Let's try and do this. Excuse me? You're blocking me. Hi. <laughs> that ladies. But is distracting. Oh! I want to see Haruka dancing.
Oof. Okay, at least I got an S. That was kind of hard. Oh, wait. Is there someone? Okay. Phew. That's it. That was a little tough. But do you think did I do alright? Did more than alright? Nice. Fantastic. Uh, oh, I've got a gift. What do I have? What, what, what? Gimme, give gimme, give gimme. Give Toughness. Nice. Alright, thank you. I'm already looking forward to the next time. Oh yeah. Oh, I can upgrade something. Oh, nice. I forgot to upgrade, but I guess that's all right because I don't really use that much, right? Promotional event jobs. Okay. Um, yes. Roof downer. Lower your opponent's spirits one level. Win the hearts uh, of the crowd. Cause your opponent's heat to fall. Boost the rate. Oh, this might be good. So I can use it easier, right? Okay. Um, let me do... Huh? Oh. <laughs> I thought someone was calling me. Nobody's in there, right? Okay. I still save. And how do I... How do I get to the other... Oh, wait, 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 wait. I want to check what... What, um... If there's any new stuff. Uh... Okay. Handshake event. Dancing all night. Magazine. Magazine? Handshake event? Wait, but that one was an interview, right? Oof. Uh, hmm. Yeah, I don't know how to... I really hope that I don't miss it. Because I already told the kids at the uh, orphanage that I'm going to do it, right? Mm, Alright, that's fine. Let's go back home. I think that's where I should go. Uh, street level. I think this is the time where I will switch to the other guy. And then start investigating possibly oh ah wait how do i ah there wait i shouldn't yeah i forgot that i shouldn't do this i should give it to the other guy whoops that's fine oh uh, okay i'm gonna ignore that Because I want to give the other guy some toughness and stuff as well. Wait, not this. It's this one. Oh, I could open. Since it's right here. Oh, I have a lot. Let's see, let's see. Yeah, I want to give the guy that... Maybe he has money. Hopefully, oh. Gravity converter. Silver plate. Alright. Not too bad. Bust amulet. There's still quite a lot of like lockers out there. So I guess it should be alright. Okay. Okay. Uh, this way. Where? Oh. Here. Okay, okay. 
Yeah, let's switch off to the switch off. Switch to the other guy. Then we'll see. Wait, do I sleep? Where do I go? Okay, yeah. Maybe I should try to sleep. Yeah. Okie dokie. Ah, uh, yep. So we switched to this guy. Evening already? Oh, hello. Uh, any news? This Oh, Hori-san should be back from the station by now. I've been calling him, but he won't answer. Uh-oh, is he... killed? Please no. Wonder if he ran into any trouble. I wish I could get a hold of him. I'm thinking of going to Dino Chair to make sure he's alright. Okay, I'll go too. I didn't really want to go alone. Shall we meet at the entrance? Alright. This is bad. Her entire career is going down. Sure, that sounds good. Okay, see you soon. Why does this seem like it's supposed to be voiced? But I don't hear the voice lines. Okay, give me a sec. Let me drink some Milo. Also, my voice seems to be going a bit. Or rather, my throat isn't on its best um, condition. Kind of feels a little scratchy. I don't know. Okie dokie. So, oh. The taking pictures thingy. <laughs> Where's this email from? I think they sent it to the wrong guy. Oh well, look into it when I get a chance. Oh. <laughs> okay, I'll make sure not to gamble. Alrighty. Alrighty. Ah, hello. Very convenient. Okie dokie. Just trying to see if there's any shinies I'm missing. Okay. Probably not. Oh no. Yeah, 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 yeah. People are gonna attack me now, right? Uh oh. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, oh, oh. No, 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 no. Maybe I should fight just to practice a bit, right? Wait, I think I can go through here. Maybe. I don't remember. I could be wrong. Oh, I can, I can, I can, I can. Oh, this way. Oh, excuse me, please. Ex oh. <laughs> wow, okay. <sighs> that was tough. <laughs> um ooh. Oh I've only noticed that the footsteps, the sound of the footsteps has changed. Oh that's cool. I like that crunching sound. It's very nice. Oh e oh what? What's going on there? Oh wait! That's in front of diner chair, right? Is that guy alright? Maybe somebody should call an ambulance. Hmm? What's going on here? What is going on indeed? Oh, collapse man. This is not Hori-san, right? You alright, pal? I know that voice. Akiyama-kun. Oh, wait, what? Who's talking? The guy on the ground? Looks like I've been volunteered to take care of this guy. Apparently. Okay. Who's this person? 
Oh, there's a shiny there. I was here. Why didn't I feel? Why didn't I feel? Why didn't I see that? For a minute there, I wasn't sure if I was gonna make it. Can't help but feel like I'm being taken for a ride here. How much can you eat anyway? <laughs> well, I definitely appreciate it. And hey, what's a little food between old friends, right? Old friends? Yeah, sure. Now, I just have one tiny little question. The question? Wonderful. Lay it on me. Who are you? <laughs> you and your corny jokes. You couldn't make a hyena laugh. Well, I made you laugh, didn't I? But seriously, who are you? Wait, are you serious? You really don't know who I am. Yeah, I don't. I'm serious. I don't know who you are. All joking aside. All joking aside. <laughs> I can't believe this. You're actually serious. You're telling me you don't remember your senior officer? The man who taught you how to survive on the battlefield. Huh? Battlefield? What battlefield? Wait a sec. That over the top. Oh. I didn't. S yeah. I didn't go to him once. Finally remembered, did you? Sort of. I do recall that you taught me some pretty useful stuff back there in Kamurocho. But I also seem to remember that I forgave all of your bills for my hostess club. So who's forgetful now? Uh. <laughs> anyway, it's been a while. How are you faring? Oh no, am I gonna fight? Oh, changing the subject, huh? I've been fine, can't complain. What are you doing here? I thought you were giving shady risk management lectures to young folks in Kamurocho. Oh yeah, what's he doing in this part? What do you mean shady? Anyway, I let my students take that over for me. Uh oh. Despite my extensive experience on the battlefield, my time in Kamurocho taught me that I still had some weaknesses. Okay. I decided to return to the life of a mercenary and hone my skills by fighting. This from the man I found face down in the street. What were you doing there anyway? It was all I could do to get the spot. It was all I could do to get to that spot from the airport. I just ran out of resources and energy, that's all. Why did you want to go there? Yes, things are tough nowadays, huh? Even for mercenaries. Make it... Managed to make it this past three days on the street. Okay, thanks to my superb survival training. <laughs> How superb can it be, right? Three days on the street? You mean you haven't bathed in three days? Ooh, okay. I don't really want to imagine the smell on this guy. Of course I haven't, and I just returned from the front lines, so actually it's been more like 10 days. Just returned from the front lines. So, actual military guy. That's disgusting. I thought something smelled funny. <laughs> that was you? Quit acting like a spoiled baby. There isn't enough water on the battlefield to drink, let alone bathe. Plenty of water at the airport, or a hotel, for that matter. Your hair's looking kind of crusty there. Huh, I thought you used to shave your head. You let it grow out. Also, it's so dark right now. Can you see through the shades? On this last trip to the battlefield, I decided to try my hand at aerial combat. What? Sorry for asking about your hair. Aerial combat? Came up with a new technique. Uh, sure. Alright, alright. Okay. Let's fight then. 
Yep, 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 yep. Let's go. Daijiro Saigo. Okay. Ooh. Press in heat mode to launch an enemy, then follow with the launch strike. Press in heat mode to launch an enemy. Launch an enemy. Kick me up into the air. Only deal damage to Saigo with the launch strike move. Try for a combo attack by rapidly- Oh, okay. I can't even do that. Oh, I managed that. That is so- Okay, I don't know. Oh. Okay. I guess I kind of did it. That was weird. That was so weird. Wait. Why is he suddenly so big? <laughs> I feel like there's something wonky going on with my game. Reminds me of that one time. Okay. Oh, oof. Are you sure you're- This guy seems to be living in his head quite a bit, huh? How could your eyes have met? Never you mind it. I'm really impressed by your reflexes. Uh, no thank you. Not in a million years, pal. Too bad. Yeah. Alright. Yeah, yeah, no. I don't want- Oh no, of course there's more. Great, great, great. Just go home. Can't go home yet. No way, not yet. Alright, no need to get worked up. I have to stay here. I have my reasons. Huh. I hope you can understand and will come see me now and again. No, thank you. You're lonely, huh? We add demons about whatever it is he's feeling though. Okay, you got it. I'll stop by when I have a chance. Alright, alright. <laughs> okay, I guess, yeah. Wait, I have an email. Uh, oh, this is the... This is the weapon shop, right? Okay. I've got a new skill. Oh, I've got three. So let's knock enemies down by kicking the legs out. Yes. Oh, okay. Uh, essence of seizing. Deliver a vicious strike. <gasps> I'm gonna take their weapons. Don't mind if I do. Okay, okay. Alright. Where's the shiny? Is it that bench? This bench? This bench, no? No, this bench. No, where's the shiny? <gasps> oh, that one. I was gonna say you lied to me. All right, so now we get back to our regularly scheduled programming. Dino chair. Wait, 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 wait. I'm walking further away. No, no, no. This way. Oh. Oh. <laughs> right in front of Haruka as well. Alright then. Come on.
<laughs> okay. Come on. Ooh, nice. Okay. Ooh, ouch. That will do. That will do. <laughs> Did I keep you waiting long? Uh, I just got here myself. Tried calling Hori-san again, but still no answer. That's alright. Let's go see for ourselves if the note's been returned yet. Note? What note? Where do you think Park San's note might be? In Park San's office, if the police have returned it. They've been putting her things in a tray there. I feel like this is supposedly voice acted though. Doesn't look like Hori Chan's back yet. No, it doesn't. Hmm. Oh, right, the suicide note, right? Here it is. So this is the infamous note. Now if we could just find some of the left-handed writing to compare it to. See anything? It's probably in the safe, right? Uh, come to think of it, she wrote Hori-san a memo just before she died. And she used her left hand. I bet it's still around here somewhere. Hey, how about that safe? It's locked. You're going to open it? What an oddly shaped keyhole. Huh? See for yourself. It looks like you can shove a pencil or something in there. Not that one. Nope, not good. Not that I expected it to work. Wait a minute, maybe. What's that? A pen Park San gave to me before she died. She said it was an early debut present. Yeah, it's that one, right? Right. Something is wrong. It worked. Who would have thought? A letter and the account book. So this is where it was. Yeah, I don't know what's going on. The voice lines are just... Is this... The letter. Aksan. Oh, I thought she was going to read it, but... Oops. It's a note from the day she died. A list of instructions, things she wanted done while she was gone. I think that's the one. I saw her writing it to Hori-san. Maybe she wrote, meaning she wrote it with her left hand. Okay. So the writing is different, right? It does look different. Yeah. It does look different. You're not even close. Doesn't take a professional to see that. So then... Yeah, the note looks just like handwriting from her right hand. 
which means it's forged. In other words, unless her injury magically healed overnight, this thing is a fake. Should we let the police know though? Haksan didn't kill herself. She was murdered. Bum, bum, bum. And all this is just an elaborate cover up. Apparently. I knew it. Ooh. Oh no. Is that Hori san? You gotta be kidding me. No, what's wrong? No, then the whole agency is bust. It's a person, someone fell off the roof. Okay, let's go. No, please be okay. I don't want Haruka's efforts to be in vain, right? Should I go up? Need emergency stairs okay i guess it's this way then oh yeah back here akiyama-san who's that Oh, it's an actual... Wait, the teacher. Who are you? I should ask you the same thing. Hori-chan! So it was you. You must be the one who killed Park-san too. No, it wasn't me. They made me do it, I swear. Who is they? This guy, though. Let me go. I didn't do anything wrong. Like, I'm going to buy that. Well, only one way left to go. Alright then. You wanted to act innocent, huh? Is your hatred for Park Sun that much that you want to kill her, though? Man. Okay. He's okay. Wow. Okay. He's the break dancing type, huh? Like Majima. That's not good. How do I... Okay, there's nothing around. Mm. Uh, missed that as well. Wait, do I have anything to... I don't... Okay, this is bad. This is very bad. Okay. What's that footsteps thingy? Oh, I missed that. You gotta be kidding me. Okay, yeah. I'm not having a good time. Oh no, I got caught it. I got caught it. This is not good. This is not good. Can I do this again? Ooh, okay. Try again.
Ooh, nice. Very nice. I should avoid when he's getting into his that stance, right? Oh, ouch. Nope, didn't work. Oh, crap. Oh. Hey, Wolfly. How's it going? Welcome in. Ah. No, 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 no. Nice. Come on. I can do this. Come on. Come on. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Second time's the charm. It's been good. Great, great. That's good to know. I've been doing pretty good. Great. I've been <laughs> I've been doing pretty good as well. Me and you can have a long talk later. Hey, Horichan. Lord, talk to me. Oh no, please be okay. Oh, he's still alive? Hang tight, I'm calling an ambulance. Yeah, I don't know what's wrong with the voice lines in this game right now. Oh. Who are you? Doesn't concern you, not with where you're going. Oh. Ooh. Akiyama-san! Eyes forward! Okay. This is a tough one, huh? Alright. Haruka, could you please call the ambulance and the police as well? Uh-oh. This is gonna be tough. And I already had troubles fighting that weird... Not weird. That teacher. Oh, You're giving me stuff? Thank you! Oh shoot! Okay. Okay. You're scary. You're very scary. Ooh, nice! Alright, no worries, Wolfly. Have a, uh, have a good rest of your day. Hopefully you manage to complete your work smoothly. Eee! Oh, I'm stunned. No. Okay. Oh. Okay. Can I? No, I can't. I don't have enough heat. That's fine. Oh. No. Well. Perfect. No, 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 go, 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 move, move. <sighs> oh, I can learn stuff. Okay, 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 okay. Uh, brick guard. Ooh, this would be good. This would be very good. Thanks for dropping by as well, anyway, Wolfly. <laughs> I just realized that I, yeah, didn't thank you. Anyway, regain your footing. Oh, space bef space right before getting knocked down. Um, sure. Wait, 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 wait. Quick step cancel. I perform right after an attack. This will lower your heat gauge though. Okay, that's fine. I'll take this. Enhance trolls. Do more damage to surrounding enemies. Maybe I should increase my heat gauge. Maximum value. Alright, let's do this. 
Okay, and then I'll take this. <laughs> Phew, alright. Where are you now? Okay, that wasn't that nice, huh? Or rather, that wasn't that good. Oh, crap. Good, not good, not good. Nice! Oh my goodness, that was nice. Very nice. Hey, hey, hey. we did it. We did it. Are you gonna tell me? Or rather, are you gonna talk? Tough. Or... You're tough. Real tough. Yeah... He's not gonna run, huh? Oh, that guy's up. Ogita-san. Oh, he knows more than he lets on, though. I'll remember you. You can count on it. Okay. Horisan? Horisan. Why? So some voice lines are there and others are not? I think that Ogita the guy did this to him. Ogita-san? First things first, we need to get Horichan to a hospital. His life depends on it. Yep. Okay. Chapter 4. Nice. Beyond the dream. Okay. I'm certain we'll find Khan Ogita sooner than later. We've put out an emergency alert all over Osaka. That's as a material witness for the assault and attempted murder. Okay. I don't think we'll be able to bring him up on charges for the Mirei Park incident. Why not? Look, it's like I said, there was trouble between Ogita and Park san. Isn't that a critical fact in the investigation of her death? Yes, well, the park incident has already been declared a suicide, and with the police having made that conclusion, you can't change it, huh? Hard to reopen the investigation. There was a Yakuza with a gun there and everything. And what about the ladder? Well, we'll get to the bottom of all that once we catch him. Hmm. Leave the rest to the police. We can't have civilians getting involved. Well, if the police is... Uh... Capable... We wouldn't have to get involved. It looks like something... Maybe they are hiding. I don't know. What did he say? Apparently, they don't believe Okita had anything to do with Park San's death. Okay. I see. Oh, thanks for going shopping for me. Uh, you're welcome. Without Hana-chan here, I don't have any decent food or drinks in the office. Am I allowed to ask a famous idol to do that kind of stuff for me? <laughs> I'm just an ordinary high school student. I'm not famous. What are you gonna do, Lynx? We can't just sit on our hands and hope the police find Ogita, right? So you wanna find him. Wouldn't be very productive for us to try and do the same as the police either. If only there was something else we could do. Can we check on Hori-san though? Do you know of any forgers around here? 
Forgers? What do you know about Forgers? A long time ago, when I first met Uncle Cass, I heard him talking about men who did that kind of thing for a living. Oh, so you think... Mm, I've been thinking about Park Sun's note. There must be a forger somewhere here in Sotenbori too. Yeah, true. You might be onto something. Anybody can fix somebody's, someone's handwriting, but it take more than an amateur to fool police evaluation. A professional forger would definitely do the trick though. Good thinking, Haruka-chan. If we find a forger here in Sotenbori, he might lead us to Ogeta and that guy with the gun. Exactly. Let me ask around and see what I can find out. Oh, hello. Uh, hello, this is Haruka. Haruka, you got a second. Oh, Yami Yama Ura san. How is Hori san? He'll be in hospital for a good while, but he's gonna make it. Alright, that's great. He won't be able to manage you anymore, of course. Uh, poor Hori san. I can always try and fill his shoes if you want. Sure. You do that for me? I want to see what happens to that dream of yours too, kiddo. Alright. Besides, when I think of Horikun and Park Sun, well, I know that you're making the debut they worked so hard for. Oh, making that debut, okay. Thank you, Yamu y Yamaura san. Also, this is kind of sudden, but I got a call saying they're doing round two of the finals. Okay. Wouldn't it look bad if I went on? Manda san heard about Park Sun, but he still wants you to go on, he said. Okay. Think you can do it? Yep, of course. Good. Glad to hear it. Okay then, I'll be waiting for you at dining chair. Come on over when you're ready. Alright, thank you. So we have two routes to go through right now. Quite a busy little bee, aren't you, Haruka-chan? No, I'm not. Oh. And now it's his turn. <laughs> Hello. Chief, can you talk? Oh, hi, Hana-chan. Yeah, sure. What's the status on the Park Sun situation? Let's maybe save that discussion for another time, shall we? Sorry to drop this on you out of the blue. Do you think you can track down a forger in Kamaru Kamurocho for me? Forger? Chief, just what are you up to this time? And what in the world does it have to do with opening the new branch? Well... Nothing really, but it's something I need taken care of. Well, take care of yourself. Take care of it yourself. You can leave me out of it. Okay then. Don't be like that. I'm begging you. Forget it. I've got work up to my years over here. With you being gone. Why does everything but actual work always come first with you? Please, Hanachan. I'll bring you back some steam buns. Steam buns? That's right. A hundred of them. Uh oh. Fine. Just this one last time. <laughs> A hundred steam buns though. You're the best, Hanachan. Now, about this Kamurocho forger. Think you can find him by tomorrow. Did you forget who you're talking to? I have it done in an hour. Whoa, Hanachan. You're the best. That's my Hanachan. Could you have him call my cell? I want to talk to him. Will do. Yeah. Don't know what's wrong with this game, but they are not to move things along. The best way to find a forger is to ask another forger. Wait for Hanachan to call back. You better get on, get going on the Princess League thing. Can meet up at Dino Chat later. All right, sounds good. Yeah, with them not having the voice lines, it's definitely going to get worse for my voice. I'm okay. Let's just go back. This might be a short stream, I think. Just cause I can't really rely on the voice acting. Um, so yeah. <clears throat> oh, what? Huh? Uh, miss? Excuse me. Hmm? Why the sudden... Aren't you Haruka-chan, that big idol? I recognize that face anywhere. That's right. 
I'm Haruka Sawamura. Thank you so much for watching. Well, would you look at that? A famous star like you just strolling down the street? Hey, I know. Why not try some of my takoyaki before you go? Me? But... <laughs> Don't worry. It's on the house. As you can see, it's not exactly busy here. In a bit of a slump, you might say. I just I can't understand it, because my takoyaki is really good. Care to give it a try? I'll try some. Alright, I'll try some. That's a good go. Here you go. Real Magutako Takoyaki. Nothing more Osaka than this. Magu Taco. Thank you very much. Phew, it's hot. So what do you think? Good, right? It really is. It's delicious. See? what I tell you? Best in the city, if I do say so myself. I just can't figure out why people aren't lining up to get it. Hmm, maybe I gotta advertise more or spruce up my stand or something. I tell you, I'm stumped. If only people would try a bite, they'll be hooked, I'm sure. Maybe you can give out free bites. You think so? Well, that's awfully kind of you to say. Thank you, Haruka-chan. Hey, if you ever get a chance, maybe you can talk about this place up on TV. Um, I'm not sure about that. I think there's some sort of um, advertising fee you need to pay for that to happen. Oh, I don't know. I don't get many chances to say whatever I want on TV. <laughs> oh, I'm just pulling your leg. You're an idol after all. It's not like you're a comedian or anything. I'm sorry. Hey, I know. Wanna be my manager for a day? If you do that for me, I can't tell you how much I appreciate it. Manager for a day? What? Hello, hey Brambo, how's it going? Welcome in. What do you mean, be your manager for a day? Like, work at your stand? Excuse me sir, you need to pay an advertising fee? Manager for a day? What would you have me do? Hmm, I don't know. Just stand in front of the shop, maybe. That ought to do the trick. No. You need to pay me an advertising fee for me to do that for you, okay? This is... I know you were just kidding, so to speak, when you asked me to advertise for you on TV. This is also advertising. Are you going to brush it off and say it's a joke again? Could that really draw in customers, do you think? Wouldn't it? I know it get me to stop by. Well then, how about a handshake event? I can shake hands with whomever buys your takoyaki. Huh? You really do that for me? No, you gotta pay me. Of course. Oh, but wait, I better check my agency to make sure it's alright. I don't think they'll have any objections though. They'll be fantastic. Uh. They said yes. They thought it would be a great idea to help out a local business. Okay. If the agency said yes, sure. Wonderful. I'll start getting ready right away. Wait. Right now? Apparently, I can leave it for later. <laughs> okay, dokie. We have a very special guest here at Magu Taco. Singer Haruka Sawamura-chan. She's agreed to be my manager for a day. Try our special bargain. A sampler tree pack of takoyaki. Only 100 yen. Each lucky person who buys takoyaki today will receive a warm handshake. Uh, <laughs> I was gonna ask, was that guy okay? He, he seemed to be stuck. Uh, we'll receive a warm handshake from our special manager for a day, Haruka. Step on up and try this takoyaki, everyone. It's absolutely delicious. I'll take a pack. Hey, you're Haruka-chan from the Princess League. I want to shake your head. So creepy. Mommy, can I shake Haruka-chan's hand too? Of course you can. Go buy that takoyaki now. I'll take some takoyaki. 
What do you say, Haruka-chan? How about some nice warm handshakes? Stop being creepy, dude. What? Nice warm handshakes. Why? For our wonderful new customers. Of course. Did I go over the handshake pretty dear? Uh, I think I remember it. So that's why. Right. That's right. That's fine. Hopefully I don't screw it up. <laughs> it's been a while after all. Hello. Bye bye. Tanoshimi, okay. Okay, bye bye. Where's the little girl? I want to shake hands with the little girl. Oh, this guy. Okay. <laughs> oh, whoops. I didn't manage to tell him something. That's fine. Okay, bye bye. Okay. Oh, why are you? Why was that? Why did why did that go down? I had no idea. I had no idea. I have no idea what went wrong with that. Come on. Oh, okay. Got to the second bar this time. I guess that's all right. Maybe. I don't know. Thank you so much for doing that. Oh no, I was glad to. <laughs> I've never seen so many customers lining up. You sure can draw a crowd. And they all seem over the moon to shake your hand. I'll wager I'm gonna have a whole slew of new regulars thanks to you. Hopefully though. This is a great success if you ask me. I better roll up my sleeves tomorrow, cause it looks like I'm gonna be busy. Thank you, Haruka. I'm just happy I could help. Here's your reward. Oh, you actually do pay me. I threw in a little extra too. <gasps> very nice. Are you sure? Thank you very much. It's me who should be thanking you. You really gave Magutako a boost today. I hope you'll be back. Well, alright. At least I got experience points. Points? Experience points. Dance battle. Are you hard? You're normal. Sure. Let's go normal. Is it that easy to tell? Alright, let's go. Hopefully I can do this alright. <laughs> it's been a while. Yurashiku. What's your pose? Oh, you're warming up. Nice. Let's go. Press the wrong button, why? Oh, nice. Hey, hey, hey. That was sort of easy. I guess because it's normal. I don't think I can do hard. Yeah. The last time I did hard, I pretty much screwed up the entire thing. 
Oh wait, what's that Taiko though? Those moves of yours are really polished. Why, thank you. Okie dokie. Uh, where... Where was I supposed to go? Oh. My mind's made up. What's going on here? Pretty sure this is a side story. Um... Is it me or this guy's hairstyle is really... <laughs> it's really weird. What's with them and having such bold style hair, right? Bold, bold style? Is that how you even describe that kind of hair? I mean like it looks like a bowl is placed on the hair and you just cut the hair according to the um, edge of the bowl, right? Free introductory class to what? Oh. And you... Normal. Rock. Alright, let's go. If you wouldn't mind, not at all. Let's do this. We gotta dance, 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 dance. Is this the same? Is this the same song as previously? I think so, right? Oh yeah, come on. <laughs> yeah, it's the same song. Let's get a heal. Oh! Bonus points! Oh, I shouldn't do spirits. I should mess with the opponent a bit more. This one is not good. Recovered. Oh, nice. I won. I won. Very happy with that. And we finished the song as well. Sort of. Yeah. Your skills are quite formidable. Congratulations, you just became my newest rival. Uh, oh, 4,000. Nice. I get to earn money too. Very, very nice. Excuse me. We have to go back to the office, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. I forgot what we were supposed to do. <laughs> this way, this way. Oh, sorry, sorry. Coming through, coming through. Okay, wait. Is it here? Oh, it's here. Okay. Hello! There you are, Haruka. Not much time until the Princess League. Uh, what do you want to do? You want to go now? Uh, not quite yet. Let me check to see if I'm ready. Could I just have a little more time? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Cutting it pretty close, okay. I want to go upstairs to check with the guy. If I can do it. Like do my evaluation, right? Hello. Are you in here? I hope you are. Yes, okay. Come for a lesson, have you? No, I want an evaluation. What am I doing so far? Do you really think I can win the Princess League? With your abilities as they stand right now. 
You know, I think you can. <gasps> Provided you don't make any serious mistakes. Ah, okay. All right, that's what I need. Let's go. I. Yeah. Let's go. Cause I think every time I take a dance lesson, right, my health goes down. So I don't really want it to like go down too much at the moment. Wait, what's my health like? Hmm. Yeah, I should. Oh, this is dramatically. Yep. Oh, maybe I should have taken this one. Restore health. I'll just heat. Okay. Oh, I should save. I should save. Yes, indeed. Uh, let's do a separate save. Okay. <laughs> yep. Let's go. I'm ready to go. Great, you look ready. Okay. Schedule board says the part that's Princess League. Round two. Here we go. Let's go normal. All set. Let's go. Wow, my voice is really going down. So fancy this place. Are you alright? Well, to tell you the truth, I haven't been in a TV station in a while. Okay. Really? Yeah, I'm kind of nervous. You'll be alright. You'll be alright, Yama Urasan. Eh, sorry. I should be the one saying that to you. Well, it's fine. Shall we go? The dressing room is right up here. Okay, okay. I'll go check it out for you first. Thank you very much. Sawamura. Who? It's me, T Set's manager. Okay. Nakai san. So, your president just dies, and here you are, huh? But I guess a tiny little agency like yours can't afford to show some respect, can it? If you excuse me. By the way, are you sure your president's death was really a suicide? Well, what? Does he know more? There's quite a few in the industry that would have been glad to see her go. Hmm, are you sure somebody didn't kill her and made it look like a suicide? I'm not gonna divulge anything to you though. I see. We are aiming for sympathy. Sympathy? Sympathy votes. Someone from inside. Hmm. If I win against T-Set, Will you promise to leave us alone and never speak to us again? Ooh. You're a funny girl, you know that? Do you promise? You want me to promise, then you gotta put up something on your end too. Oh. If you lose, you have to switch to our agency. <gasps> you, after all that you said, you wanna scout me? You could be an opener. Wow. Wow. No. No way. Oh, I guess, yeah, I do have to put up something that's equivalent in, um, yeah, sure. Now it feels like if I do win, right? <laughs> Asking them to not talk to us is a very small or low uh, bet, right? Also, the voice lines are not working for some reason. Uh, no, you can do it. Take that T set down a pack and you'll be on the top idol, I suppose. I'm not sure. It seems like it might be working on stream, maybe. I just realized that the voice thingy is... Or rather, the game audio is sending out. 
All right, thank you. So I'm not sure if it actually is sending out or it's just on my end. Or it's just on my end. I'm not sure if it's sending out. Or it's not sending out. Um, yeah, okay. I don't know what I'm thinking. But let's do this. How's everybody doing out there? Okay. There is sort of a faint voice line there. I think that might be the backing track or something. Decide which performance is best. Okay. Lend all your support. What are we gonna do in this round? Dance, right? <laughs> Graceful dance moves, noble elegance, okay. I have to really win this, right? Diamond in the rough has allowed us to see her sparkle. New on the scene, glowing brighter, okay. Oh, I forgot to go to talk to that. Mm. That lady that might help us, right? Will I get to do a outfit change? I wonder. Okay. Loneliness loop. Right. Let's go. Should have said that earlier because there's not many notes in this part. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Go Haruka, you can do this. Oh, okay. Concentrating so hard. Ah. 
Ah, always that one. Okay, I don't know if I won that, but yeah, that was bad. Always messed up at the um that part. Alright, please, 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 please let me win. It's a concert battle. Alright. Please? Please? Fingers crossed, fingers crossed. Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. And for final round bonus is. Please, 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 please. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. This must be so exciting for you, going to the finals. Yes, I'm so shrewd. Uh, climatic round. Tell us your thoughts. I'm not that confident. I have a strong desire to win more than anyone, I think. Yep. So in the final round, do my best. To express my sincerest feelings to my friends. Are you gonna interview the other two? Oh. She win in the final round, who knows? There's three rounds, right? So I guess. And did everyone enjoy the show? Mm -hmm. Can't get enough of you girls. Just run out of time. Yep, yep. <laughs> I like that they have like the fake credits. Well, yeah, for the uh, TV show. Maybe they are real credits. I don't know. You did it. Now all that's left is the final round. T-Set will be fighting for their lives out there. You have to give it everything you got, right to the very end. Yep. Right. Let's get back to Sotonbori. You're supposed to meet Akiyama-san, right? Yes. Just don't go overboard. Alright. be honest, I'd rather see you spending extra time on lessons and the like. Well, they'll be standing by, come see us anytime. You got it. Thank you. Yes. All right, let's go. Going back to the office. Must be tired. Go home first before coming back. All right. Thank you. Hope you'll be okay though, because you took over Hori san after all. Hello? Oh, are you free right now? Just finished taping. Must be exhausted. Oh, I was hoping we could get together and talk. I'd like your voice coach to be there too. Oh. She should be a dining chair right now. Let's meet there. Alright, I guess we do go to dining chair instead of home. Is this about a forger by the way? Uh, this is something else. Anyway, see you soon. Okay. Alright, alright. I'll head on over. Um, this way... Oh! That's where the magazine interview is. Oh, I should go. I should go. Yes. Let's do this interview first. Yeah, we finally... Okay. Hello, I'm Haruka Sawamura. It's very nice to meet you. Welcome to something. I'm Yara. Oh, from Okinawa. Born and raised. Haha. 
You could tell from my name. Yes, now I feel like I'm back home. That's great. <laughs> You'll make for an excellent interview, don't you think? It certainly will. We wanted to make this unique, so we asked Okinawan children to write to you letters for the magazine. Ooh. Response was overwhelming. Greatest volume of mail we've ever received, in fact. You must be quite a celebrity there. Really? That's amazing. Space for the article is limited, so we picked just three letters. I'll read them to you, and then you can comment. Sound good? Absolutely. Alright, the first letter is from a 6th grade boy named Professor Cosmos. That's a pen name, I assume. Yes, all three letters are written under pen names. I guess Professor Cosmos is a big fan of outer space, huh? Probably. Anyway, here we go. Dear Sawamura-san, I saw you dancing on TV. Wow, you're so cool. I'm not athletic like you. I can't do even one pull up, and the other kids make fun of me. What should I do? Start small. I can't do a pull up either, but start small, right? And don't be discouraged. I had the same problem when I was a kid, so any advice for Professor Cosmos? Uh, prove them wrong. I'm so sorry that. The other kids tease him, but why not turn those feelings, turn those hurt feelings into inspiration? Yeah, exactly. Spite is a very good uh, motivation. He said he liked my dancing. Well, when I first started, I couldn't dance well at all. It took so much practice. My dance coach would probably say that I'm still not good enough. But the important thing is to learn something new and just feel good about that. So my advice is to keep trying. Yep, pretty much. Very wise. I think Professor Cosmos will be encouraged by that. Second one. Now then, on to the letter number two. This is from I Heart Riona. <laughs> okay. I guess middle school boy. Yep. They will have such names, maybe. What? Yeah, that pen name caught me by surprise too. What a romantic fellow. An Okinawa boy. Oh. Mitsuo. Maybe. Okay. And Professor Cosmo said he was in sixth grade. Could that possibly be Shiro? Saomura-san? Oh, sorry. Oops, I better focus. Here's what it says. I did wonder if all three letters were going to be the kids from the orphanage. Dear Haruka, I've been watching you on TV and rooting for you, but I kind of get jealous of everyone else on TV. They're all so good looking. There's a girl I like, but I don't think she likes me. Do you think it's because I'm not very handsome? Um, There's a possibility that she thinks you're not very handsome. Because I think kids that age is very into the uh, face, right? Only when they mature a bit more will they think that it's uh, personality that's better? Maybe? I don't know. Any kids around <laughs> that can provide some perspective? No, I don't think so. Kids probably shouldn't be watching this anyway. I think Yakuza is like a 18 plus game, right? So yeah, kids, you probably shouldn't be here. He's rooting for you. Must be a big fan. Sounds like a passionate guy. As for his romantic dilemma. Dilemma? Dilemma. Looks aren't the only thing. Yeah. 
Looks are a big part of what first attracts us to a person. The entertainment industry certainly puts an emphasis on looks, that's for sure. True, but they aren't the only thing. When a person truly likes someone, it has much more to do with personality, I think. For example, how kind a person is, or how trustworthy. Character can play a bigger role than appearance. Even in the entertainment industry, it counts for something if you are attractive on the inside as well as the outside. What I'm trying to say is, if you really like this girl, show her the quality of a character and see what happens. Good luck. That's very nice. I'm sure your words would mean. I'm sure your words will mean a lot to I Heart Riona. Now for the third and final letter, is from Dragon Mask Man. <laughs> this is the guy that likes the uh, wrestling, right? I forgot his name. A boy in his second year of middle school. Oh, uh, is there something wrong? Oh, no, it's nothing. I misheard you. I'm sorry. Dragon Mask? There has to be Tai Chi, yeah. All three of these letters are from Morning Glory, I'm sure. Now I see why Ayako told me to do a good job at this interview. Um, are you ready to continue? Oh, yes, please. My apologies. How do you do? How do you do? <laughs> Why is Tai Chi being so formal? <laughs> How do you do, Sawamura san? I always watch you when you're on TV. You're the main topic of conversation at our house. I do apologize for the racket in the background. We used to have people who were like a mother and father to us, but they both left on long journeys. Now I'm the oldest boy, so I've been trying to be responsible and dependable like they were, but it's not easy. What can I do to become more like them? Hmm, very interesting. Wow, he sounds like a very mature and thoughtful young man, wise beyond his years. Any advice for him, Sawamura-san? Any advice? Hmm. It sounds like you've been doing great. Just keep at it. I'm sure all the younger children look up to you because you already have those virtues you admire in the two people who left. Ooh. Besides, those two weren't perfect. They made all kinds of mistakes. Oh, we're revealing a bit too much, huh? So don't worry about what you can't do now. You're already helping your family a lot. Wow, Sawamura-san. Oh, I'm sorry. I... No? Please don't apologize. I think... I think... Dragon Mask Man really needed to hear something like that. You print it exactly the way you said it no edits why thank you very much that's very much appreciated oh wonderful i think the interview went well hopefully those were some fascinating answers thank you for coming and thank you very much for having me you gave some fantastic answers i'm sure the children who wrote the letters will be thrilled oh I hope so. Um, would it be possible for me to read the rest of the letters that were sent in? Oh, sure. I actually have them right here. Shall I have them sent to your agency? Yes, please. Oh. Take them right now. Okay. Are you sure? That's a lot of heavy paper to carry around. I'm apparently very strong. It's okay. I'm stronger than I look. Okay. You got it then. 
Here's some compensation for your time. Oh, wow. That's a lot of money too. Thank you. We hope to have you back soon. Alrighty. I like that very much. Okay, we finally did that interview that I've been looking for. Wow, lots of letters in these bags. I'll be sure to read and answer every, one, every last one of them. Oh, you want to answer? Okay, okay. Those pen names were so silly. <laughs> Did they really think I wouldn't figure out their true identities? <laughs> they remind me of someone else I know. Ooh. They couldn't talk to me directly, so they wrote letters. <laughs> They're so cute. <laughs> Apparently they're not heavy at all, if I can be swinging them around like that. It looks so light. <gasps> 4000! Very, very nice. Okay, okay, okay. Let's get my skills up. Oh. Okay. Oh. Is that... That's a side quest, right? That's probably a side quest. Uh, let's see, let's see. Adorable allure. Spirit. Maybe I should bring down the spirit. Heal me. Recover even more of your health. Lowers their health. Maybe I should boost this. Oh, I can't. Okay, that's fine. I thought I had. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's fine. It's fine. Let's go back. No, no, no. This way. This way. Let's go back to the agency. Oh, is this a... Uh, maybe it's that one. I don't know. Okay, that's fine. Hmm. Oh, sorry about that. Oh, I, I, I always get stuck in this alleyway because of the amount of people. Whoops. That wasn't on purpose, but I suppose it looked like that. Oh, hello. Sorry to keep you waiting. Sorry about all this, especially right after your princess thing. It's alright, I'm fine. Okay, shall we head in? Let's go. I wanted to save though. That's fine. Alright, in we go. Oh, Haruka. Akai Akiyama-san. Akiyama-san said he'd like to talk to us. That's right, it's about this agency. What about? I want you to hear this too, Yamaura-san. Alright. What do you want to tell us? Uh oh, what's going on? Found Park-san's account book. We thought the money I loaned Park-san had disappeared from the safe. But it turns out that wasn't the case. Looking through the account book, I found out the money had already been spent. Oh? Park-san was sure Haruka-chan would win the Princess League. So sure in fact that she arranged Haruka-chan's big debut in advance. Oh. I've been talking about Haruka doing a concert in Tokyo for a long time. There's more. You haven't heard where she wanted to have it. I think once you're here, you understand why it costs 300 million. What do you mean? She re reserved, get this, the Japan Dome. The Japan Dome? For a new kid's debut? How on earth was she planning to fill that many seats? Knowing Park san, she probably had an idea or two. But I guess now we'll never know. I wonder if Park san wouldn't tell me the venue. The Pan Dome? It's absurd. I assume it's a very big place? I think it was important to Park san that the concert be at the Japan Dome. Why do you say that? It was a dream, right? 
But she told me, Park San almost got to perform at the Japan Dome back when she was an idol herself. I get the feeling all her hopes and dreams revolved around that place. What about you? What do you want to do? I want to fulfill it though. If the Japan... If the Japan... Do oh, okay. Yep, she's talking, right? That's where I have to have it. As her last idol, I'm the only one who can carry on Mirei Park's... Something. Without Mirei Park or Horikun, what can we possibly do? Tiny Shad still has you. I can... Okay, I could never put together a concert. Okay. Don't have that kind of expertise. You're forgetting about me. Oh, Christina-san, do you overhear? I have quite a bit of experience running even bigger concerts overseas. I'll help you organize it. Besides, what kind of professional would I be if I didn't see my job through to the end? Wow. Alright. Top now is seeing that Haruka becomes a top rank idol. Uh, this is a Japan dome we're talking about. Uh, just stop at simply reserving the venue. Pretty much. Probably did something else. Hired a full event staff as well. In any case, it's certainly something you could look into. Once we have an answer, we can decide if it's actually doable or not. True. Come on, get your courage. Fine, let me do some digging. Then I'll need a little time, of course. Mind if I go over that account book? I guess not. Getting a look at those expenditures will help me know where things are and who to call. Park was wise to hire you. Yep. Thank you, Yama Yamaura-san. Starting today, you're the boss of this agency. Park san would have liked that. I'm sure Hori-chan will be on board too. Ooh, that's right. She's in charge now, huh? Okay. Just get yourself ready. I wonder if her being in charge... In I wonder if her being in charge would put her into danger. Oh, this is our forger friend. Right. Hello? Is this Akiyama of Sky Finance? This is he? I got a call from his secretary. She asked me to call you. Oh, just an hour past. You are the forger, the one from Kamurocho. You have to ask? What's, what's this about? You have a job for me. I don't have a forging job for you exactly, but I'll pay you nonetheless. I want you to hook me up with an Osaka forger. More specifically, one in the Sotenbori vicinity. What would you want with him? I need him to forge a suicide note. I have a sample of the handwriting. Oh, in that case, I have somebody in mind. Okay, so we got... So how can I get in touch? It's not like we're best buddies or anything. Little place called Crest Bar. Crest Bar? You might try asking the bartender. Thank you. My secretary will forward you the payment. We got a lead on this part as well. That's nice. Not a place for you, Haruka-chan, and it's late too. I'll be going this one alone, alright? Okay, okay. Yes, I understand. I'll be waiting here. Just let me know if there's anything I can do. Alrighty. Okay. Oh, no, no, no. I don't want to go in. Whoops, I wanted to save. I got stuck at the door for some reason. Okay. Um. Also, also. Should I do it right now? Guess, yeah. Because the voice lines are not, apparently not playing right. My voice is definitely worse right now. So, oh, where did they go? Did they just disappear? 
Okay. <laughs> right. Um. Maybe I should. Yeah. Okay. Maybe I go on for a little longer. Just a tiny bit longer. Just a tiny bit. Because I definitely feel it. Right now. Oh. Ah. Got a minute. I was hoping to talk to you about Haruka. Okay. To me. What about? Don't tell Haruka. But I think she might have a stalker. Oh. Something happened. We were walking back to her apartment late the other night. And I caught some weirdo. Was following us. I don't think Haruka noticed, but after saying goodnight, I came back out, and that same guy was still there, watching from a distance. What happened then? I was scared, but I went towards him to get a better look at his face, and he took off running. I figured he must have been spying on Haruka. Interesting. Has anything like this ever happened before? There's plenty of wacky people with all sorts of crazy ideas. If Haruka's fan letters are anything to go by. There's no end to them. Okay, so you are fielding the fan ladders so that Haruka doesn't get any of the weird ones. But this time the stalker knows where Haruka lives. That's what worries me. Our agency has neither the staff nor the money to keep watch over Haruka. Still, it's not exactly something we can just ignore. Yeah, it's not. So I was hoping to ask a favor for you. Would you mind taking a look around? Every so often? Okay. Sure. If you spot anyone sneaking around, I'd like you to give him a stern talking to. Sure, but I think he might be a little too optimistic if you think that'll be enough to scare them off. <laughs> that is true. I don't think it would be enough. Worth a try? I might be just a man for the job. Counting on you, Akiyama-san. Okay, so I'm supposed to head to the bar, right? But... Oh, hello. He does have a couple of locker keys, so I think I want to go open those lockers. Just cause I get stuff. I don't have any healing stuff on me, so... Yeah. Oh. Excuse me? What was that? Huh? What? I'm so sorry. I wasn't paying attention. Are you okay? Oh yeah. I'm fine. What about you? She seems... Yeah. Looks like you took the worst of it. Yes, I'm fine. It's just that I'm in a bit of a hurry. Oh, sure. Go ahead. You don't have to worry about me. Where's she going? I'm so sorry. I have to go. Do we know her? There's a girl in a hurry. Wonder what's going on. Huh? Why did I get a phone call? Hello. Hey. It's Yama Ura. Okay, I was wondering, are you free right now? You just- <sighs> Okay. I should be. What's up? Sorry to drop this on you all of a sudden. But do you think you could head over to Ashitaba Park? Why? A talent, a girl, got lost. So I told her to go there and wait. Oh, is that the girl? <laughs> Her name's Strawberry Maya. Her agency's pushing her real hard right now. You know her? Not really. Can't say I do. Yeah, that's understandable. Her agency's pretty small. It's totally on me, but it completely slipped my mind that we're supposed to be looking after her just for today. Uh-oh. See, her manager's getting married today. Ah, and since our agencies are pretty tight with one another, we agreed to look after Maya for the day. Stupid me, I forgot all about it. And our schedule's booked solid. 
And you want me to pick up the slack? Bingo! I'm glad we're on the same page. Alright. I'll be fine. You run your own company, right? Yeah, 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 sure. Okay, dokie. Uh, pretty much just her chaperone. Okay, so I just bring her to places. Being promoted as a naturally perky, quirky girl. So try to keep her in character. Naturally perky, quirky girl. Hmm, she's what now? <laughs> Same question. Maya's actually pretty. Maya's actually really timid and proper and the like. But they're pushing her as a silly character. I see. Why would they make a girl like that adopt that kind of persona? Good question. That's just gonna be such a drag to keep up, right? I don't know. It wasn't my call. Please. Alright, alright, alright. Yes, 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 yes. Okay. Oh. <laughs> you do tell me. Okay. Meet up with Maya. Bring her to dine a chair for a magazine interview. Take her to certain TV for love to see you smile. And finally, she's to appear on Sotenbury Love Chat Quiz, also at Sotan TV. Okay. You get all that? Don't forget the order now. Okay. Magazine interview. Love to see you smile. And then Love Chat Quiz. Okay, let me write this down because I'll probably forget that. Mag interview. Uh, love to see you smile. And then love check who is okay wrote it down looks like i do have to keep on going all right let me go to the lockers first okay can i even do it though oh i can okay wait i've got three this one Oh, this one. Oh, weapons. Very nice. Pocket tissues. <laughs> okay, that's fine. Let's go to the park. I think. No, wait. The park is not here, right? Where's the park? Oh, I can upgrade. Might as well. Um, Taunt enemies. Don't really think I taunt people that much, so... Affinity of strikes. Sure. Okay. Let's check- oh no no no, I wanna check the map. Ah. Fuck is this one, right? Yeah, okay. Straight and left. So it is this way. Now let's go. Poof. Alright, alright, alright. I want... Flare. Uh, I should probably look at the um, places a bit more right oh are those fighting people probably not okay where is the idol so late at night as well uh um <laughs> it's her yep huh aren't you the young lady who bounced off me earlier I'm terribly sorry about that. Um, I'm Strawberry Maya. Yeah, it is her, right? Huh? You are? Yes. I beg your pardon, but are you Akiyama-san of Dining Chair? Well, sort of. I'm not an employee of Dining Chair, but... Yeah. Um, but I was asked, so... Hopefully... Yep. I'm so glad you're here. See, so you got lost. Is that why you were in such a rush? My sense of direction is awful. I walked all over Sotenbori, but I still couldn't find Dino Chair. <laughs> well, actually, you're pretty near Dino Chair. 
Okay. Magazine interview. First stop is a magazine interview. We have to go to the giant chair for that. Okay, thanks so much. Let's go. Oh, I don't have to walk her there. Nice. Alright. Could you wait a moment, please? Everything alright? During interviews like this, I always get my manager to guide me with cue cards. Oh. Cue cards. So you can read off them? Yes. I'm supposed to be a naturally perky and quirky character. But if I don't watch it, I go back to being my usual ordinary self. I see. To avoid it, I had my manager guide me with cue cards. Could you please do that for me today, Akiyama-san? Uh, sure, that's fine. But I'm gonna I'm going to need you to elaborate. What exactly does a naturally perky and quirky character look like? The basic premise is that I'm a princess from the Strawberry Kingdom who is secretly visiting Japan. Okay. Yo, what? <laughs> also, to indicate motion, emotion, Maya always changes the final word of a sentence. If she's happy, Maya says, Palump. If Maya is angry, she adds, Pon. Like, Maya is not happy, Pon. Okay, am I supposed to remember all of this now? If she is confused, she strikes a pose and says, Funyapa. <laughs> okay, okay. What was it again? Happy, it's Falump. Angry, it's Pon. And confused, it's Funyapa. Funyapa? Oh, maybe it's Funyapa. Funyapa. Maybe. No, no, no. You need to strike a pose. Like this. And strike a pose. That's confused. Um. Okay. You're braver than most, you know that. Yes, honestly, it's something I would rather not do. Whenever I see myself doing it on TV, well, it's kind of hard to live with. I guess you do have to... Yeah. If the manager isn't quite quick enough with a cue card, I have to say something to avoid any awkward silence. Ah, uh, that's why you need a cue cards. Okay. I'm not so confident about doing that. I really need it. If I break character, my boss will kill me. Mm, okay, I'll do the best I can. That's the... Yeah, that's the most I can do. I'll try. What's this? What is this gonna look like, huh? Oh! Oh my goodness. Okay, so this is an outfit, huh? Oh! Sorry, had to drink some water. Beginner magazine. Okay. Yes. Hoping to delve a little into Maya chan's private life. Oui. Nice to meet you, Palump. Palump. Happy, right? Yeah. So, Strawberry Maya. Strawberry Maya chan comes as advertised. Are you always like that? Even when you're not on TV. Oh, we have to lie, right? We can't tell them that she's not like this, right? But of course, Palump. Maya is the princess of the Strawberry Kingdom, after all. <laughs> okay, her hair accessories. Is this supposed to be a strawberry as well? Blue strawberry? Uh, yes, yes, you are. Forgive me. Wow, Maya Chan's really laying it on thick. She's normally so serious, so sincere and serious too. It must be tough for her to keep it up. Yeah, I can imagine, right? I can't let her effort go to waste. I have to make sure I get her cue cards right. She says palump when she's happy, pawn when she's angry, and fuye. Funia, funia pa. If she's stuck for an answer, okay. Oh, stuck for an answer. Okay, I guess. Yeah, confused. All right, all right. Q 
Can you tell us how you spend your holidays? What does someone like you do on their time off? Maya can't do without her strawberry carriage. She just loves taking it out for long drives. She's really in character, huh? A strawberry carriage? What is that? The strawberry carriage is a giant strawberry drawn by white stallions. The premise is... Drawn by white stallions. I'm sorry, did you just say premise? <laughs> Whoops. Uh oh. Oh, uh, um. Off to a great start, I see. Okay, here's where I come in with the cue cards. Oh. Maya didn't say that, Bon. Is that so? I'm pretty certain I heard you say the word premise. Uh oh, that might be... That might be the wrong answer. Did not, Pawn. Oh, well, if you say so. Uh oh. <laughs> she managed to tough it out. Oh, okay. I guess this is how I'm supposed to support her. Alright, alright. Final question. Receive credible reports that you're actually from Osaka, Maya-chan. Would you care to comment? No, not true. Maya is the princess of Strawberry Kingdom. Pawn. Wow. There are photos circulating online that are purportedly of you from your junior high yearbook. Were you aware of that? Pardon? Is that true? This doesn't look good. I went to the school and spoke with one of the teachers. She said that you were a timid but rather thoughtful and considerate student. Uh oh, uh oh, are we gonna get exposed? Uh, well, you see. Let me ask you straight, is it hard to keep up the Strawberry Maya Chan character? Don't worry, this can be off the record. Oh, I don't think we should trust journalists with off the record stuff, especially if it's somebody that we don't know. Because we can't really trust them if they will do it. This could be a feint, right? They said off the record, but they still put it in instead. Because this is like a unspoken rule, right? When you say off the record, it really has to be off the record. But sometimes, you know. This interviewer's not playing nice. Maya needs a cue card. What should I write? Uh Oh, I Uh oh, no. I didn't click that in time. This is annoying. It's okay. This is off the record. Uh uh, uh um oh shoot. Funya pa. Fu funya pa. Ah, you returned my serve, did you? Bravo. That takes a real pro. Kudios. Ku Kudos for your de dedication, Maya-chan. Whoops, sorry. I wanted to click that. Oh, she didn't want to fool Nyapa unless she had to. Well, in this case, you do have to though, right? Uh-oh. That's one job down. I'm sorry about that. Thank you. But we still have more to do. Okay, what's next? Um, Love to see you smile. Let's go! Oh right, you're going to be on Love to see you smile. Let's get you over to Sotan TV. Oh yes, please. Oh, this is... I hope I don't have to do anything. If it has to be like cue cards again. <laughs> I'm really bad at it. Oh. Welcome, welcome. How is everybody doing? Love to see you smile as a talk show. Oh. It is cue cards. And we're on TV right now as well. This is bad. Sorry. Taking a drink of some Milo. Okay. I have to know, do you really have fans? Oh, we. Very much so. 
I enjoy the love and support of everyone in the Strawberry Kingdom. We, oui. isn't this French? So she's supposed to be kind of French, I guess, as a character, I mean. Let's set aside the kingdom of strawberries for a sec. How about Osaka? Oh, do you have fans in this neck of the woods? Wee oui, wee. Oui. I'm adored in Osaka too. How dare you doubt me, Nomusan? Pon. How do you. Pon. Is that how you're supposed to say it? Okay, so far so good. Well, you'd be cute if you weren't babbling nonsense. <laughs> Word of advice that bit about the Strawberry Kingdom isn't, do ya, isn't doing you any favors. True. Huh? It's not? Of course it's not. When someone comes in with a weird gimmick like that, it makes it hard to engage in banter. Okay. If you ask me, Maya-chan, you ought to go to your agency and talk it over with them. Maybe consider switching up your brand a little, you know? Something proper. I suppose? But isn't there... I guess a market for such characters as idols. I don't know. I'm not familiar. Uh, but I... This calls for a cue card. What should I write? The Strawberry Kingdom is real, Pon. It's not some made up story, Pon. My, you're an obstinate one. Don't you find it tiring to ke keep up that quirky, perky charade day in, day out? She does, but she can't show it to you. No, not at all. This is just who I am. Please, you can't fool me. Even when you do that, Funia power pose. Your eyes tell me you can't stand it. Oh, <laughs> true. But Funia power is uh, a standard greeting in the Strawberry Kingdom. It would be silly for me to find it humiliating. Oh, come off it already. Incidentally, who taught up that Funia power anyway? Who? Uh. Uh oh. Time for another cue card. What do I write this time? <laughs> I hope this is the right one. I don't think so, but well, we'll see. Uh, uh um. Funyapa? Oh, come on. That's not fair. Uh oh. I have to admit, the Funyapa thing's convenient. Even if Maya-chan doesn't like doing it. It is pretty convenient. Okay, sorry about that, but here, yeah, one more job to do. Yes, quiz program. Uh-huh. Uh, maintain the quirky image. You have to get the answers wrong. Is that right? Yes, that's right. Oh, cannot answer correctly. Wow. She's in such a, I don't know, this agency. Yeah, it's really, an, it's really not a right fit for her, I guess. This branding, I mean. They don't make it easy for you, do they? The quiz is made up of true or false questions. If I'm to answer incorrectly... I'll need to know which answer is actually correct. Okay, I need to give her the right answers so that she can answer wrongly. Not that I'll pick the wrong answers for her. This is scary. Well, either case, I do need to know the answers, right? Okay, I get that. Need you to guide me with your cue cards. Will you please help me? Of course. I'm right behind you. Alright. Oh no, this is going to be so bad, isn't it? Okay, this is Sotenbury Love Chat Quiz. Welcome to the show, Strawberry Maya-chan. 
Uh, Maya Jan, you're well known for your quirky ways, but some rumors say you're actually a quiet, serious, and relatively ordinary person. Why is this rumor spreading everywhere? All three places that we've been to have just been going about on that. Oh, no, 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 I am not quirky at all. I am the princess of the Strawberry Kingdom. Ah, please forgive me. Now, let's begin, shall we? Okay. It's time for Sotenbury Love Track Quiz. Okay, let's get the cue cards ready. For Maya-chan to stay in character, she has to give the wrong answers. Oh. Huh? Wait, this is different from what it was before. She has to give the wrong answers, meaning... I have to give her the wrong answers. Wasn't I supposed to give her the correct answers so that she can give the wrong answers though? Between Osaka Prefecture and Tokyo Metropolitis, Osaka is the bigger of the two. Ah, uh, I have no idea. I have no idea. Oh no. Anyone knows in chat? <laughs> True or false? Um, prefecture though. Prefecture. This is Metropolis. So I guess Osaka is the bigger one because it's prefecture. And Tokyo is just, I guess, only the city area? So it should be... The correct answer is true. The false answer is false. I'm gonna say false. Oh! Whoops. Two times three times four times zero divided by two equals zero. This is true because anything divided by zero is zero, right? Oh, wait, maybe it's one or minus one. No, 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 I think it's zero. So it's true. So it should be false. Please be, please be wrong. It would be funny if I'm trying to get it wrong, but I got it all right. Ah! <laughs> okay, 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 okay. We're doing this, we're doing this. Question 3. Dolphins are mammals. True or false? Dolphins? Wait, this is supposed to be a... Sotenbury love track quiz. Why are you not asking me about Sotenbury stuff? <sighs> Dolphins are mammals, true. So, it's false. This one's false. Okay. Question 4. Idol and idol. Both are people. Oh, this, this is a trick question. As a person, you can idle by, right? But is it asking me... Because this is not exactly a... Uh, object, right? It's like a... Description. An action. Oh. <sighs> So the correct answer is false, so I'm going to say true, right? Oh, please be wrong, please be wrong, please be wrong. Ooh, nice. <laughs> it's so weird to be happy about getting it wrong. First computer ran on batteries, true or false? Oh, 
Did it run on batteries? I guess it did. True, so it should be false. It must be false. Oh! Darn it. Okay. So the first computer didn't run on batteries. What did it run on? Final day of July is the 31st. True or false? I have absolutely no idea. June... Uh, what is... How do you... Oh, there's that trick to figure out which month has which days. July is 31st. Does July have 31st? Okay. Okay, I'm gonna cheat. Okay. And check my calendar. <laughs> Just cause I really don't know. Wait, wait, wait. Um. May... July does have 31st. Okay. Okay. Good to know. Good to know. So it's true. I should give it false. Come on, come on. Please be wrong. Please be wrong. Nice. How many did I get wrong now? Question 7. Legal drinking age is 18. Legal drinking age for where? Japan? I think? If it's Japan, I think it's 20 or 21, right? So it should be true. I hope it's true. Ah, uh, okay. <laughs> Question 8. H is hydrogen, O is oxygen, and Na is nitrogen. 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 Is it supposed to be nitrogen? And that's a spelling error. Na. Is it really nitrogen? Uh, nitrogen? Nitrogen. Oh wait, I don't even remember this now. Na. Maybe. So, it's spelled wrongly, right? So I guess it's true. Okay. For sure, true. Hehe. <laughs> nice. Two more questions, I think. French toast did not originate in France. I have a feeling that is true, so it's gonna be false. I see false. Incorrect. Nice. Question 10. The French Revolution came before the Russian Revolution. Oh my... Why are you asking me history questions french revolution came before the russian revolution which revolutions are they talking about is this the one is the russian revolution the one that they overthrow the czars or is it the bolshevik Rest revolution. Is that? Oh my goodness. I'm trying to <laughs> pry my brain open for my history and knowledge. Oh, this is bad. French Revolution is. Was it Napoleon? Wait, is Napoleon French? Or was that Italian? Oh my goodness. I'm gonna be flamed for this, aren't I? Uh, but did it come before though or was it a result i feel like i feel like it came after the russian revolution 
I'm assuming this one is talking about the Tsar. The one that they overthrew the Tsars. So I guess it's true. Uh, we'll know. We'll know. Why, that's true. Oh! Okay. So French Revolution was before the Russian Revolution. Which revolution are they talking about? You know what? I need to go Google. <laughs> like, which revolution is happening? I need, really need to... Uh, brush up, I guess, my history. Anyway, did I pass? Did I fail? Ah, results are what we expected. Were the questions perhaps too challenging for a princess? It is, I guess. Oh, we oui. indeed they were. Much too hard for me, Palomp. Happy. Thank you for coming, Strawberry Maya. Join us next time on Sotenbury Love Chat Quiz. This is not Sotenbury Love Chat Quiz. You've given me... <laughs> mammal questions? History questions? Science questions? I disapprove. But I guess I did a pretty good job. Maybe. Hopefully. Good job. Appreciate you bearing with me. Oh no, Akiyama-san. Thank you for putting up with me. Sorry I'm so high maintenance. Not at all, Maya-chan. You're doing all the work. I admire your commitment. Thank you. Something wrong? I don't know if I can keep this up much longer. It feels so forced and fake. Trying to go forward with a character who's nothing like me. Yeah. You should probably change that, right? What originally prompted you to market yourself this way? Oh. My manager told me I would never make it if I took a conventional approach. But it's really my fault. I'm usually so timid, and I get all flustered when I talk to people. What I really want is a job on a children's TV program where I can sing together with the kids. That's a very... um... Noble? Noble? Uh... A very... What's the word? Commendable? Goal? Job? I mean, you know, because she just wants to make children happy, right? Always like children, and I used to play with them every day. Really? Well, when you put it that way, your character might not be so out of the line. Kids love that kind of thing, right? I suppose so. But I'm not sure it would work for an idol. It might work for like a TV programmer. Programmer? TV program. Right? Hmm, I don't know. I thought so, too. But I've only ever appeared on variety programs. I haven't done a single job where I get to sing with kids. Maybe you have to... Let your manager know to try and get you a job. Or rather a gig like that. I don't know. That's why I'm wondering if it's even worth it to keep pretending to be someone I'm not. What good is it if I can't even follow my dreams? True, true, true. Maybe I'm just not cut out for this. The poor girl's exhausted. As a manager, I should try to cheer her up. Um, Akiyama-san, do you think I should drop the whole silly Strawberry Kingdom thing? Oh... Doubting yourselves helps you grow. You know, doubting yourself that way often helps you grow. Pardon? Everything you're going through now is helping to make you stronger, you know. Everyone on their way up suffers bouts of self-doubt. That self-doubt swirls cre creativity and innovation. It makes us grow. 
true. There's no need to find the answer right this instant. Take out the time you need and find your own path. My own path, indeed. Even those who have found success don't stop seeking their own path. If people stop doubting, they stop growing. I see. So it's only natural that I agonize over my career like this. Pretty much. Thank you so much, Akiyama-san. You've lifted a huge weight off my shoulders. I may have been completely out of line in saying that. I am just your manager for a day. It's not as though you have to take it to heart or anything. Oh no, please. You've given me the courage to keep going. I'll stay princess of Strawberry Kingdom. Doubts and all. Yeah, keep up the good work. I'm so glad I got to get that off my chest, Akiyama-san. I don't dare speak to my real manager about this. Oh? Who's there? Hmm? You expecting someone? Uh, well... And, uh, you are? Do I need to fight? Huh? What do you mean? You don't know who I am? Huh? Sugihara-san. Who is that? Ooh, her eyes are wide open though. So she's shocked? Maya-chan, you know this guy? Um, yes. Haven't you heard, Akiyama-san? Sugihara-san is a big name in the comedy world. Oh, is this the same guy that was coming up to Haruka? Alright, I may have seen him on TV. So what brings you here? Um... Has been offering me a spot on one of his regular programs, but... Ah... Uh, yeah... Yeah, it is this guy, huh? It's just I... Not to worry. Come on my show and you'll be riding my rocket. <laughs> is this a euphemism? Um, you see. Hey, I can understand your concerns. It's a big career move. Why do you say we grab a bite somewhere and get to know each other a little better? Am I gonna fight him off? Say, Maya-chan, is this guy hounding you? Yes, I've been turning him- I've been turning down his advances. People tell me I have to watch myself around Sugihara-san on account of his new thing for newcomers. Praying on them, right? Hey, who are you? You ain't the usual manager, are you? Sounds to me- Ha <laughs> maybe you should be the one. You're right, I'm not a manager. Then get out. I got things to discuss with Maya Chan in private. Since I'm not her manager, right? So if I beat him up, he wouldn't go back to her. Possibly. Hey hey hey, we found a loophole. Sorry pal, no can do. I'm her bodyguard. <laughs> what? You have any idea who you're talking to? So you're a big name in comedy. Wouldn't you know it, I'm not involved in the entertainment industry in the slightest. Huh? In other words, you could be the emperor of entertainment, but as far as I'm concerned, you're just another sleaze. What? If you want to keep running your mouth, I suggest you keep that in mind. Oh. Oh. Oh, he left. We don't need to fight. Thank you so much, Akiyama-san. Eh, sad to think guys like that actually exist. Show business is a scary place. <laughs> and you're laughing at the comment. Okay. I'll take you back to Sotenbori. It's been fun, but I'm afraid our time together is over. Yes, I suppose it is. Oh no, it's over. It's over. Ooh.
Okay, I better get going. Hopefully you can find your way back now. <laughs> Akiyama-san, hang in there, Maya-chan. I'll be cheering for you from the other side of the TV. Take care. Not so fast. Uh-oh. Oh, you brought back people, huh? Okay then. You little punk. I'll show you what I'm about. Let me show you what I'm about. Really, you know, for a big star, you're amazingly petty. Everything I wanted, I took and made it mine. You wanna make it big? You gotta be determined to take whatever you want. Sounds very... Mm, okay. It makes for a very punchable character. You make for a pretty good speaker if you're hit. <laughs> I'm not gonna read the whole thing. Alright, what should we do? No problem. Keeping talent safe is part of a manager's job. May I ask you to step back a little? Sure. I'll show ya. Get him boys. He'll be singing a different tune once we rip his arm off. Well, we'll see about that. Yakuza. Hmm. Okay. <laughs> oh, you're fighting as well. I did not expect that. But sh oh, you just did like that? How pathetic. Uh. Oh. Oh. Managed to do that. Nice. Oh. Get up. Get up. Wow, you're taking your own sweet time, huh? Hello? Okay, I guess I can still kinda hit you. Oh, alright. That was way too anticlimactic. <laughs> Wait, what? All disguise? By yourself? I'm out of here. Well, you asked for it. You are amazing, Akiyama san. You alright? I'm so glad you were my manager today, Akiyama-san. But now this really is the end, isn't it? Oh, you said? Yeah, that's how it goes. I get to meet all kinds of people in this job, but things tend to move so quickly. I usually never see them again. Thank you so much for everything today, Akiyama-san. Thanks to you, I was able to focus on my work. That right? Glad to hear it. I'm usually very guarded around people, so I was worried about not having my usual manager to steal me today. But I'm very glad I got you instead, Akiyama-san. So um, if you don't mind, may I give you these? Oh, what are you gonna give me? <laughs> this lady is stuck, huh? <laughs> and I just saw like a shiny there. Are you okay? You got stamina royale. Oh, very nice. Thank you. Raid jewel. What's that for? <laughs> she really is stuck. Usually, like NPCs being stuck in the background gets um free after a while, but she's been stuck for. I think, the entire conversation. Maybe. I'm still poor, so that's all about. So that's about all I could give you to show my gratitude. Sorry it's not much. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. No, no. You made my day. Thank you. She did make my day. Because I don't have any meds yet. Uh, pretty high maintenance. I'm painfully aware of it. Yeah, well, it definitely made the manager job a lot more interesting. I'm sure your regular manager feels the same. You really think so? Well, I was your manager for the day. I like to think I've earned at least that much trust. <laughs> okay, you have. Alright then. Thank you so much. That's a lot of thank yous, right? <laughs> Goodbye. She's still stuck. 
That poor lady. I hope you get to go home. Keep at it, Maya chan. Oh. Ooh, nice level up. Very nice, very nice. Okay. Ah, uh, she's not there anymore. Oh. Why? Why is that guy there? On the bridge as well. Mm, that's a bit suspicious. Let me go grab this shiny. Where's the shiny? Huh? Where? No, I was lied to again. Oh, sorry, sorry. Oh, is it on this? Oh, it's there. I don't want to trigger that though. Excuse me. Coming through. Ex ex okay, fine, 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 fine. I'll go to the other side. Okay, please don't trigger. Oh, it's right. Examine. Okay, 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 okay. Don't mind me. Just gonna pick this up. S let me just scoot over. Okay. Yep. Alright, alright. See you later. <laughs> okay, can't believe that worked. Alright. Oh, we need to go to the bar. That was a roundabout way, but um, no, 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 no. Oh shoot! Oh shoot! Okay. Is there a safe around here? Um, please let there be a safe. Oh, it's back there. Yeah, back here. Oh wait, there's a safe down here. So maybe I just go all the way down here. Safe. And then we can pick it up again next week. Because yeah, it's three hours and my voice is really going. Uh, this one lowers heat gauge though. Do more damage. Boost the amount the heat gauge rises. Oh yes, please. Okay. So yeah, let's just go on ahead. No, 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 no. Okay, fine. Fine, 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 fine. You asked for it. Let's go. Nice. That was easy. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. You're too much. You asked for it though. These people, <laughs> they asked for the fight and yet they are so, I guess, regretful. I don't know. Oh no, 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 no. <sighs> all right, all right, all right. Another qualifier. Yep. All right then. <laughs> okay, I guess I can't do it because he's down. Oi! Ah. Didn't press it in time. Oh, that's fine. That is fine. Had enough yet? <laughs> Why can't I beat you? Well, no ordinary street, street, street punk. Confidence. Okay. Oh no. No, 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 I don't want to talk to you. No, 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 no. This is the second one, though. Okay. Bye. Oh, that pose, though. Oh, no, 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 no. Ran in the wrong direction. Great, 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 great. All right, then. 
I guess you really don't want me to end the game, huh? His moveset is so fun, actually. It's so much more fun compared to the tank guy. I know I complain about the tank guy like almost every stream. <laughs> but yeah, I really don't like the tank guy. Ooh, nice. Alrighty, I'll take that. Hey, this way down. Please don't be- oh. Oh, this is the stalker, huh? Okay. Mind telling me what you're up to? What? Who are you? I'm with Dynachair. Ring a bell. You're from Harukan Chan's agency. So it is a stalker. Yep. So let me ask you again. What are you doing here? Oh, uh, well, you see. I- nothing. Later. Hey, stop. Oh, it's chasing. <sighs> alright, alright, alright. Oops, sorry about that. Lady. Oh, shh. Oh, missed that. Oh, ah, uh, no, 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 no. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on. <laughs> oh, I missed that. Oops. Okay, so that would happen to... Ah, okay, get up, get up, get up, get up, get up, get up. Uh, troll. Okay, I can't do that. Alright, alright, alright. That's fine, that's fine. Excuse me! Oh my god. Come on. Come on. Oh. Okay. I managed to catch it. Catch it? Catch him. Now, what do you have to say for yourself? Hmm? 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 Alright. I'll ask you nicely. Quit skulking around Haruka-chan. Stalking is an actual crime. You know that, right? You got it all wrong. I'm no stalker. I was just trying to keep Haruka-chan safe. That's... no. Are you trying to gaslight me? That is stalking, you know? That's what they all say. Indeed. I swear I'm not lying. Haruka-chan really is being stalked by you. No admission of guilt, nor any sign of remorse. Okay, you had your chance. What do you say we call the police? I'm not lying, I'm telling you. Look, there he is. Oh. Him? That's him. He's the real stalker. I see him wandering around Haruka-chan's apartment all the time. <laughs> so Haruka has multiple stalkers then. And why do these people have her address. Did she get dogs? Hmm? You're serious? See? There he goes. He's the stalker. You gotta believe me. Another chase scene then. Alright. Why do they always have to run? Why indeed? Game, please. I just wanna save. And rest my voice. Why do you gotta do me like that? Oh. Oh. Nice. Ho oh ho. I managed to press that correctly this time. Left, right, right. Oh. 
Ah, uh, I missed it. I somehow always managed to miss it. I was trying to. I was focused on trying to get the uh, bottle. Did I actually run faster than you? For a short while there. Okay, nice. Gotcha, gotcha. Now, what do you have to say for yourself? <laughs> let me know, let me know. They've got me running all over town, so pal. Tell me, are you the real stalker? Stalker? You got it all wrong. I was hoping to protect. How many? Oh jeez, not you two. Fine, we'll let the police sort this out. Wait, wait, wait. I really ain't a stalker. Look over there. There he is. Uh, a thug? Don't try to pretend you're not, you creep. I've seen you stalking out Haruka-chan's apartment plenty of times. You take that back. I ain't no stalker. I'll have you know, I've been keeping- What? <laughs> How far does this go? Hey, Mellow Out. What's going on here? Hell if I know. Where do you get off calling me a stalker? I'm gonna keep Haruka Chan Haruka Chan safe from the likes of you. Say your prayers. Oh, an actual fight. Alright. We should really let the police sort this out, I guess. Because it's really not for us to say anything. Oh, just one person. That's fine. Very easy. Simple enough. Oh, so what was this all about? You tell me. Would you care to explain, please? I'm not a stalker. I admit I found Haruka Chan's apartment and I hung around hoping I could maybe see her. That is the definition of a stalker, though. I noticed there was this shifty guy hanging around there as well, so I told myself I had to protect her. It was some guy in a tracksuit. Wait, that's the same as me. I saw this brute sniffing around Haruka Chan's place. She needed protecting from him. <sighs> okay. I saw that creep in the suit acting all kinds of suspicious. I was trying to keep Haruka Chan safe. Wait, me? Am I the one in the suit? Alright, alright, I've heard enough. Basically, all three of you are whistling the same tune. You all tried to keep Haruka Chan from a soccer, and you all got mistaken for one. What a mixed up bunch of white knights. How silly can you get? Well, it's a good thing it wasn't serious. These guys seem harmless enough. Just some fans who took things a little too far. Harmless enough? Mm, it's still pretty scary though, right? Sure cost us enough worry though. You stay away from Haruka's place from now on. If I see you again, I'm calling the cops. It won't happen again. I'm not sure about that. Please forgive us. Sorry for causing your trouble. Thanks for clearing this up. Alright. I suppose I should thank you. Huh? How about this? Oh, sure. I can't gamble though. My luck is apparently very bad. Okay. And now <laughs> I need to run back to go save. Oh. <laughs> I was gonna say, is he drunk? But I guess he really is. Uh, oh, that's a fighty fighty person. Um, please don't come after me. Please don't come after me. No, 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 no. I'm just gonna go away. Okay. Great, 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 great. Escaped. Where's the safe? Hey? Ah, here, here, here. Okay. Alrighty. Yes, let's save. And I'm gonna call it. My voice is really going. Alright. Oh, upgrade. Sure. Um, five. So I can upgrade two. Let's go with this one. Health. I should probably boost health. Okay. Nice. Let me do a save again. Just because. Just because. Alrighty. Okay. And there we go. 
And yeah, I'm calling it uh, right now. I'll probably yeah continue this next week as well. Next week is... Hmm, I'm not sure if it'll be the same schedule, but for this game, it will be. So maybe I'll see you next time. Um, yeah. So thanks for watching. Thanks for lurking. And um, yeah. Have a fantastic one.